Have you just got a Hammersmith and Fulham PCN? I got this ticket a while ago and managed to avoid paying it and I want to help you out with yours too. I've had an embarrassing amount of parking tickets but over the years I've discovered that there are different ways to appeal them. I'll take you through my six point checklist but first I've got to let you know what could happen if you don't pay. PCNs like the one that you've got from Hammersmith and Fulham Council are not the same as private parking tickets, they're actual fines unlike parking tickets from private companies which are more like invoices. So the last thing that you should do is just ignore a PCN from Hammersmith and Fulham Council. Councils like Hammersmith and Fulham will often give you a 50% reduction on the fine if you pay it within 14 days. So if you're not planning on appealing then paying sooner is going to be cheaper. But you can appeal if you've got a convincing case and then you might be able to avoid paying entirely. After having my fair share of tickets over the years, I've decided to arm myself with a stack of information and now I know how to fight back. Which brings me to the six point checklist. Have you heard of a grace period? You've still got 10 minutes after your tickets expired to get back to your car before Hammersmith and Fulham Council can issue you a ticket. If this is the case for you, then you have a legal right to appeal. You could go back to the scene of the crime and check that all the parking signs and road markings are totally clear. Don't be afraid of being a bit of a stickler and taking photographs of everything that could even be slightly unclear as this may help your appeal or if it comes to it, your defence in court. Remember, it's Hammersmith and Fulham's council's job to have clear signs about parking and CCTV and if it isn't clear, then it's their fault, not yours. When did your ticket arrive? If you didn't get a ticket physically stuck to your car and it took longer than 14 days to arrive in the post then you might be entitled to more time to gather information for your appeal. If you can prove that an emergency stopped you from getting to your car, maybe you ended up in hospital or something else equally as drastic, then you've got a good chance of Hammersmith and Fulham Council accepting your appeal. It's really unlucky if your car broke down in the car park, what a rough day, a breakdown and you get a ticket. I can't help with a breakdown but it can be a legitimate reason to appeal a PCN. You can chat to your breakdown recovery company to provide you with proof. If you're a bit of a worrier like me and you want a professional opinion then you could speak to a solicitor. In-person solicitors are great if you like to chat face to face but there are also online solicitors you can use like Just Answer. It's really easy, you just tell them what happened in the chat and they'll give you a professional opinion about appealing your PCN. It's only a fiver for a trial to get all the answers you need and it could save you a lot of money. There's a link in the description if you want to check it out and support my channel.